Nice to see you again, guys. Are you looking for a method to downgrade iOS 15 to the previous iOS 14? Do you find the methods introduced in other videos are complex and difficult, as you have to restore the IPSW file and backup with iTunes or Finder? Besides which, there are many problems that may occur in this process. Well, that's why we made this video. Today, we're going to show you an easy way to downgrade your iPhone from iOS 15 to iOS 14 with all the data kept. Surprisingly, you don't need to do the things mentioned above. With our method, all it takes is a few clicks. Let's see how to do it. First, you need to download the UMended software to your PC. I put the link in the description in case you need it. After launching the software, you can see three options on the main interface. Choose Standard Repair, and then connect your device to the computer. You may need to put your iPhone into recovery mode or DFU mode. Just follow the instructions on the screen to finish the whole process. Here, we recommend you choose recovery mode as the steps are much easier. Then you can see the details of your iPhone. Under the firmware version option, click and choose the iOS 14 version from the drop-down menu. Now, all you need to do is wait patiently. When the download is ready, click Start to install the firmware on your iPhone. Then you're all done. As you can see, my iPhone is running iOS 14 now, and all my data is still on the device. Okay, that's all for today. With UMendit, you can downgrade your iPhone from iOS 15 to iOS 14 easily. If you find the methods shown in other videos, which include backing up your data, then restoring the iPhone with IPSW file, and finally modifying the backup and restoring it to be too difficult, and your PC kept crashing as a consequence, you can try this method instead. Good luck! If you have any problems, please comment below so we can discuss them.